scariest bit of the day, that. Hello and welcome to Climbing Daily. Today is part two of our time with Blue Ice and we've come up the Agro the Midi to test out the new Shooker Light harness. Uh, this is Max. Max is a, a the technical director. director. <laughs> <laughs> give you, almost didn't, didn't give you a good enough title there. Technical director of Blue Ice uh, and you were sort of integral with the testing part of this new harness. The goal with this harness was to basically try to make the lightest harness on the market. Um, so that was the main goal. Um, so it is super light, uh, 87 gram for a medium size. Uh, so through the testing, we actually realized that this thing is as comfortable as light. The plan for today is we, we're going to play around on the top bit of the Cosmic Serret probably, uh, do a bit of abseiling with this, do a bit of climbing with this, and just, well, we might as well. This is like our playground. So uh, yeah, this is yeah. a good day at work. Okay, so we've come to the top of the crux for the Cosmic Serret, and what we're going to do is just abseil down uh, and then reclimb it, basically. So, how does this harness work in terms of abseiling? It's got two loops. Yeah, so toy. So it's a, you know, that's a little different from um, using classic harness with one uh, belay loop. So we always have to tie into those two loops. Best way to do is is try to have a directional carabiner on it uh, for most of the day, so it keeps things nice and clean. Uh, and then it can be used for re-clipping um, a bowline or the end uh, of the rope if you're on the glacier and stuff. Uh, so I tend to keep mine just on all day. Same thing as before, just keeping everything sort of clean, neat, yeah. out of the way. Okay. Yeah. Cool, let's, uh, let's get down there and then yeah. climb the crux. Cool. Let's put this uh, double loop super light harness to the test. I'll see you at the bottom, hopefully. Hey, it works. Right, so now we've come down, it's time to go back up again. It's kind of fun, this. So there we go, crux bit of the Cosmiques are at done. Now we've just got to step around the corner, Chamonix drops away beneath us, and we finish up some exit chimneys. Good test for the harness so far, bit of abseiling, bit of climbing, bit of scrambling, little bit of mix coming up. So yeah, it's been good so far. Max, thank you so much for taking me yeah. up the uh, the fun bit of the Cosmics are rare anyway. Um, the harness was sort of in its element, wasn't it? So it was like a ridge climb, um, no massive rock section, so perfect for that kind of harness. Yes, totally. So, you know, that was that's the whole point of this harness. It was like to trim it down, to be able to take all the gear that you need, you know, for ridge climbs and, and climbs where you don't need 
a ton of equipment, so you want to go really light and fast. Thank you so much, man. Well, we do product testing properly, so thank you very much. Cool. If you guys want to buy the harness, it's what, end of November? Yeah, yeah it will be in the stores end of November of this year. Awesome. Right, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you soon.